Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. So I have some items that I'm going to be relisting on Poshmark. And I just wanted to show you guys like uh, how quick I can get some good stuff to put on Poshmark. Like just in, um, my sister-in-law for example just gave me a bag of stuff. And I have stuff from my daughter's closet with tags still on it that doesn't fit her. So this is just some of these items that I like to post. Anyways, look at these pants. Super cute. This is all clothes, no jewelry. We went grand sailing today. It was fun. We didn't get too much. Here's another awesome sweater for Poshmark that I just got. Okay, looks pretty good. I don't think there's any staining. Yeah, that kind of looks good. I hate anything white. White and me, we don't mix. We're no good. Nope. This cute little summer romper. This is a size 16. I think it's Roxy. Sorry, Justice. It's got the little shorts. So, I mean, I could probably list easy each of one of those items, $10 to $15. Probably end up selling something for $5. So, this is the bag from my sister-in-law now we're going to go through. Here's her set I can be, I'll be listing. Excellent condition. I'll check the comps. I don't know if there's any brand on this. I don't see a tag, but um, it feels really nice, like really buttery. And we got oh, some Capri. Uh, these are Joe Fresh. Nice color purple. Those will be listed. We have Blessed and Kiss. This is a flannel. Sorry. Flannel. That is in a 2X. And then we got these pants. Like, I'm not sure if this was even worn. So we have that pajama set that I'll be listing. And then we got. Get stuck in here. More good stuff. Like I never paid anything out for any of this, so um, that's always a plus, right? These are Warehouse One. Again, two X. I might do it as like a pile based on the size. Oh, this is mine that I bought today at the dollar store. <laughs> we, my kids and I went out grad sailing earlier. And then my brother gave me a lawnmower. <laughs> Thanks, brother. And then this is what they had packed up to donate. And I'm like, I'll take that. <laughs> and then it was, so this is Rock Recipes. Oh, you guys can't see it properly. Cookbook, $24, $25. And I think I might keep this one, actually, because there's some good recipes in there, actually. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I'm, I'm watching. Oh, this is an instant pot. Little timetable. That must go with that. Oh, this is a bandu that you just, you know, bandu it across the whole girlies. Like, how cool. Well, oh, that's my receipt from the dollar store. So then we got some more little bags, cookbooks. I'm not sure if this came with stuff that they purchased, but some of the tea fall cup rakes. Instant pot. I wonder if there's an instant pot in there. 
Okay, I'm pretty sure she said that there was going to be some scrubs in here, so I will definitely be able to list those as well. Awesome. I'm not sure what scrubs you usually go for. So these are curtains that she spilled some bleach on. So, I don't know. I don't know if we should spill some more beet bleach on them to give them that bleached look. You know what I mean? Because these are really good curtains. I don't know how to fix them, though. But, I don't know. We'll see. If there's a will or a way, let me know in the comments if you have a will or a way. But these are pretty good. They're like uh, cotton material. I don't know what I'm going to do with those. I might keep those. We'll see. We shall see. We got this little bag. What is from being a registered Shemai dental hygienist? Darling. Another little fun bag that I'm just going to keep for the kids. Alright, so we have some shorts, plus size shorts. That I will be listing on Poshmark. They're in good condition. This one here, I might just donate. That's just one of that work shirt. Oh, look at these shorts. Yes, these are going to be a good one for reselling. Maybe I'll do them in a lot, possibly, based on size. So that's probably what I'll do. I'll lot these up. Right? You guys, we got some good stuff on Poshmark. Next, we got, oh, I got a bag of buttons. Okay, that this is a good surprise bag. I think I said I was going to keep this one because it'll be nice for me. I like it. See, here is a XXXL Old Navy shirt, good condition. Here's another Old Navy shirt, I think. Oh, Hurley XXL, that's a nice one. A really nice one, actually. That one might be a keeper for me. And then a list of this in here looks like some more scrubs and oh, we have got some more shorts actually. These are really nice. Oh no, these are scrubs. Oh, I like these though. I should start wearing scrubs. They just look comfortable. Yeah, these are really nice, actually. Oh, man, we got some good stuff here. So, see, do you see what I'm saying? Like, how easy it is for me to source what I'm listing. Like, I rarely, um, if I can get it for free, then obviously that's a plus, right? So, like, even when I go digging it in my own closet, go digging in your brother's closet, <laughs> Go digging in hubby's closet. Like, I'm sure you can source things um, without breaking the bank to be able to make a little extra dollar on Poshmark. Like, Poshmark is gold. Gold. I really do um, do pretty good over there. So, I am going to be listing these scrubs and that summer shorts and... All of this basically is going to be photographed and then um, I will do some comps. Like I'll look up comps. Here we got a long john set. I believe it's in a larger size. 
two pairs actually of men's long johns that have never been worn by 3XL. Another pair of shorts here. There's a ton of them. Walmart. So yeah, I'll probably create like a men's lot for 40 bucks. And I'll end up selling it for probably 25 usually. I'll give a discount. And then 20% comes off of that. Or, um, and then they pay for shipping. So that's always the part I like the most about Poshmark is the shipping. I don't have to worry about that. Poshmark does. But you guys, this was great. Like, I could probably make make a few few hundred dollars maybe out here. Hopefully, I will. Uh, look how good these are. Okay, I gotta check some comps and find out what is happening. We got one more of these. Yay! I'm happy. So that was good. Go team go. Oh, I heard one more thing in here. What is it? We've got coasters. Oh, these are cute. Oh, no, they chipped a little bit. So this one says, tied the knot. It's got a little thing on the back. Uh, love, laughter, and happily ever after. Eat, drink, and be married. And there's a little chip on that one. He shot her heart, so she's stealing his last name. And then there's a chip on that one. So there you go. I'll be able to do something with those as well. And these buttons, like, cool. I wonder where all the buttons came from. Let's ask where the, the, what's the button story. <laughs> oh, this one's pretty. This one's like a little flower. Alright, yo, this was a good haul again, like, the kids and I went thrifting this morning, and I didn't get any footage at the garage sale, but I think they're going to be on for a while, and I also got a ring from there, a sterling silver ring, actually, for 10 cents, so I'm pretty happy about that, it looks like a Walmart ring, I think Walmart jewelry is, usually has this RN stamp, or, sorry, Avon jewelry, not Walmart, so, we will... I'll probably have a list that ring for easy 30 bucks. We'll see. But, uh, yeah, it was a good day. It was a good day on my Poshmark adventures. Because I was able to source some really good listing items for free. Free is the way. Have a good one, guys. Please subscribe. Bye. Here is the ring. 925RJ7. Dream, believe, love. Love, dream, believe. Cute little pinky ring. I got two and cents today. See what I'll list it for. It's really nice. Yay.